Okay, so now we have the wall completely out. The wall that was the bearing wall that was holding up the ceiling. As you can see, all the studs are removed. This was the floor where it was. Some extra shoring up of this ceiling. You can never have too many pieces of wood holding yourself up here because if she comes down, your house comes down. You don't want that to happen. So the next step is to get uh, these joists cut so that the header is going to fit right between them. It's about six inches wide. And we're going to use Simpson brackets to attach these joists to the side of this header. And then you can see the name better. Bitter header. Okay, so now we have everything notched out straight down. And you can see this header is just going to go right up into place. That's the next step. Okay, so we have the lifts here. We got one on each side. We got the header up already. Why don't you come take a look and see how the head is sitting on the lift? Okay. We got the lift on the other side. You can rent these lifts. Yeah, we look and see how we're going up. I'd say we're about almost three feet off the ground already with it. And our next step is to take it home. All the way up. Okay, so she's pretty high in the air now, about six feet off the ground. This is how we're working the lift. Go ahead, give me a crank. Okay. Okay. Okay, so we got the header up. You can see it's up there with the joists and between the joists. We didn't put the Simpson hangers on yet, but it's up. We have the pole under it, as you can see, and that's not mounted in yet. But it's in position. That's 95% of the job. We've still got this uh, temporary jack here just for extra security. Looking good, looking good. The only other thing is uh, to mount everything up. Then we can take down these temple walls and continue the construction job. Okay, so now we have it finished with all the Simpson hangers in there. You can see what we got going. The beam is up and in. Mounted them to the ground, the pipes, as you can see. Bolts. Mounted it right into the beam. You can keep the height, you can keep them all level. All the joists, we use the string as a guide. Good tip there. And she's pretty much in now, holding up the rest of the house.